I'm Lil from Made by Marley and today I'm going to be showing you how to simply upcycle an old shelf, uh, oh, sorry an old drawer and make it into a shelf. It's a really simple quick tutorial and if you can get your hands on any kind of drawers I always like to have them because you can use them for all sorts of things. I'll be using the Craft Blank Word Stuff on the drawer so today I'm going to be needing a drawer some chalk paint and some um, glue to glue your, your decal onto your frame and a hanger for the back of the drawer to put it onto the wall. So I'm um, just going to take you with me while I do this. I better get rid of my glasses. I'm using um, the Stoleum furniture paint. It's antique white. So I like it because it's not too stark a white. Um, it's a kind of ivory sort of white, a kind of off white, which, which I quite like. So I'll be using this on my drawer and I'll see if I can pan the camera down for you to see it. So this is my drawer. It's a kind of arc type shape at the front. This is where the, the hardware was I took it out and I'm really not going to do that much about it because I'm going to leave it so people can understand you know what it actually once was so it's a little bit it's been painted in the past it came out of an old piece of furniture um i think the old piece of furniture was cut up to make something else out of but this, these drawers there's a couple of them so i'll maybe do a few different kinds of tutorials but this is the drawer um so i'll get started with the paint um let's get it open so I'm not going to have you watching, oh, maybe I just realised I to give it a wipe down first, um, just to get rid of some of the glossy bits. It has been out in my stable, so um, I don't want any glossy bits. As I said, it's been painted before. I think the it was turned, the drawers itself was kind of like an old fashioned dresser and it was turned into a sort of um, TV sort of stand for for someone that I sold it to. So the drawers were taken out because they needed the places to put, you know, like their, their gaming equipment and everything. So, so done. Um, I'm not even going to get that a minute because it doesn't need to be the most amazing paint job. When it's finished, the kind of oval bit is going to be the top of the drawers and uh, top of the shelf and unit and this is going to be the bottom. So it's more of a kind of display and you're not going to fit much onto it. It's just going to uh, be something fun to look at. Um, so I'll start painting. So I'll I'll just start. It's going to need two coats so I'll just... Um, do the rest off camera and um, once I've done it I'll be back once it's had its two coats of paint. So while the drawer's drying I'm just going to give the the word the decal a coat of black paint um, just so that they kind of dry at the same time. Um, these will come all sanded so you don't have to worry about them um, and then I will this will only need one coat because I'm just painting it with black um, acrylic from Art Discount. That's the paints I always use. Um, they're, they're really good and they come in 500 mils, which means that, you know, I mix them up, um, the pigment from the acrylic into matte emulsion and make my own chalk paints um, with them because they're, they're, they're quite good for, for doing that. Um, and they're good. So... I, I won't paint this while everybody's watching. I'll I'll go off and I'll paint it, and then I'll give the drawer a second coat, and um, then we'll put this all together. The drawer's all dry. It's had two coats. You could probably have done with a third, but I'm going to kind of shabby it up a little bit with a little bit of sandpaper. So I'm quite happy with the way it looks. Um, I'm just going to kind of like roughen up some of the edges, just to give it that kind of. Farmhouse sort of look. Not too much, just a little bit. Don't really want to have that green short And Let's 
Sí. direct him away from too much that it starts running out the, uh, the other side although it's all going to be on white drawers so I'm not too concerned about you seeing the glue. So this is just a simple way to upgrade a, a piece of old set of piece of drawers or but I mean really you can do I mean and I'm going to be doing a series of different tutorials but you can do like get old crates and we do things like um like dolls or books and get old crates and put the words on and give them a coat of paint and instantly you've got you know like an upgraded piece of furniture and it's personal to you it's it's personalized and that's that's good that's that's nice and i think it it kind of teaches kids to put things away it, it kind of organizes your life better right okay so this is where this goes because we've got furniture blanks that for drawers that say you know like jeans and tops t-shirts that kind of thing so that you know you can organize your things so our craft blanks are good that way so now i think there's probably enough uh, glue on that it doesn't take very long to stick it down and I'm gonna put it, I think about here. Got a little bit of the sand and powder on it, but when I sanded the chalk paint. Right. I don't really particularly want to pick it up, but that's how it looks. Now, I was intending to put a hook on the back here, but because there's a rim edge and it's quite a thick one, um, I'm just going to put I'm just going to put two when I nail it up. I'm just going to put two nails on all the oh that's the graph blank came off that will hold it. I'll just stick this back on. I don't think I can be showing it on camera right now when it's um, not stuck down properly. So um, that's it for today i'm gonna show it once it's up on the wall and it's all staged out and show you how simple it is to make a little display shelf at home so this is made by marley and um, keep an eye out for other simple craft tutorials that you can use our blanks with or just a, sometimes i just do craft tutorials just because i can so keep an eye out if you like this please subscribe and if you have looked through my videos and you think ah oh, she's worth them um, like sharing some of this stuff then feel free to do that i'd love it have a nice day